Fox Brothers Robert Ray is in Capitola Beach. It's an iconic, lovely town. It has about 10,000 people, and you know it, it's known for hosting tourists. It's known for bringing people in to let them experience the beauty of California. Robert, this new storm that's come through has has wrecked even more havoc through LA and the Southland. But what a mess it leaves behind everywhere it goes. It does. I, I, you look at this at Capitola Beach this morning as the light has finally come up and you see, look at the size of this tree uh, that was pushed down the mountainside by a creek swirled up into the Pacific Ocean and now lies here a dormant, unfortunately, as so much of uh, the forest from up in the hills uh, is made its way here to this beach. Uh, there is just a mass amount of debris here, seaweed, logs, people's belongings. Uh, and then, of course, you know, you see in the distance over there, uh, the village. Uh, those are residences, those buildings that are all colorful, that are boarded up. People actually live there. And many of those took in uh, the, the surge uh, from the pounding waves and the sand, and they've been cleaning that out for days. And we have a break here this morning in rain, which is incredible and very welcome. As a matter of fact, the sun is over the Pacific Ocean. You can actually see the sun right now as the beautiful waves and the surf come in. A very different look from what we experienced yesterday as we saw 10, 15, 20 foot waves. And then this past weekend, 25 foot waves. But as you mentioned, this is a tourism town. Uh, the economy is fully based on that. About 10,000 people live here uh, just south of Santa Cruz. Uh, in this beautiful seaside village known for its surfing, its dining, uh, and other unique shops. And many of them are literally uh, in shambles, uh, like what you're looking at here. One of the famous restaurants, Zelda's over there. Uh, the floorboards were pushed up by the water rushing, destroyed, everything strewn apart. Uh, and I saw pictures, they did not want to release those, but the pictures actually look like this here, uh, the sea moving in uh, to those businesses and restaurants. And they're gonna clean up, they have to. Uh, that's their livelihood here. It's all about the tourism. Uh, and they wanna be ready for spring break. But as you know, and we've been talking about, we're not done with these systems, uh, not even close. We've got another round and another round. And we just hope that the people to the south and Santa Barbara and Montecito are okay as those rivers and all uh, exploded and, and all of that water rushing down the mountains yesterday with the evacuations. Uh, a tremendous scene and a huge swath of geography that is the state of California, Amy. Yes, it's unfortunate because there are so many places, various impacts, various uh, looks at what kind of damage is being done in different places. But Capitola Beach, one of those familiar spots that so many people can relate to. And uh, it's heartbreaking and tragic to see what they're going to have to put back together. It's created a lot of memories for people. Robert Ray, live in Capitola Beach. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.